great little dog. He um, is a very easy keeper. He's very sweet. He just wants someone to be here with him and sit with him and give him lots of attention. He does well by himself though as well. Um, he loves to go for walks. <laughs> he loves to play around. He has a lot of energy for a 10 year old. And his only real issue is that he can't really be let off leash because he doesn't have really good recall at this point. Um, but he knows the house rules. He, he's great with other dogs. He's great with cats. Uh, and he's easily trainable, especially with food. And um, he's just very sweet and wants a family of his own. I hope that Gary gets a, a family that has at least one other dog to keep him company. Um, it would also be nice if the person who gets him is maybe retired, semi-retired, that would be home for a good portion of the day to spend time with him and take him for walks and such. Um, he is, you know, he is a very good dog on his own though, so if someone does work full time that's not going to be a problem, but you know, he's, he's 10 years old and he just wants someone to sit with him, so it would be good for other pets to be in the house. Like I said, he's great with cats and other dogs, so he's really easy to be put in any situation. I don't know about small children though, I don't know if he's ever been around them, um, but he loves meeting new people and everybody on the street, doesn't really matter who. Gary is about my 29th or 30th foster dog. Uh, interesting work, seeing all these different pets with their personalities and trying to find them their perfect home. It's not um, as hard as you'd think it would be to uh, give these pets to another home once you've had them for a while. It's really rewarding work because you get to work with these animals and rehabilitate them and a lot of times you get them to trust people again. So it's really you know a fun a fun job and it can be done temporarily it doesn't need to be done for several months you can be a temp foster for a couple weeks for a couple kittens that aren't old enough to go to the adoption center yet or for a dog that's going to be transported um, and they're not all sad cases so it's 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 a very important work it's very rewarding and it's easy once you get into it to um, have your instincts of who would be a good family